guys, it's Jen here, and I have a few helpful tips for you on Data Studio reporting. The first is gonna be how you can manipulate a page filter so that it just goes by different graphs and tables that you've created, and the second is gonna be how to export that data after you're done building the table or graph. Let's check it out. Okay, so once you're in Data Studio here, you can see your tables. All the information is in both here. And then up here, you can see the page filter. So if you did want to view a certain page, not all of them, click a couple here, you can see it's changing both tables, which is not what we want. So let's say we only want to change the top table, we can actually do that. So let me show you how to do that. So let's put our pages back. What you want to do is go in to edit, and then you're going to click your table, and then control, and then click the page filter. Right click, you'll see the word group, click that. And you're going to see this box appear around both elements. That means they are grouped together, so this should work now when we filter our pages. So we're going to go up to view, give it a try here. Only select a few pages. Let's see what this is. Okay, and then you can see that top table is the only thing that changed, and the bottom one here stayed the same. And then a friendly reminder, if you do want to export it, you can actually do it into Sheets or Excel, which is a great little tip. And that is how you manipulate a page filter. And it's as simple as that. I hope these tricks helped you, and we'll see you again next time.